allow me to invite all of you to, uh, to join me in a toast. Long life of His Excellency uh, William Samuel Rutu, President of the Republic and Commander-in-Chief of uh, the Kenyan Armed Forces, and uh, his spouse, uh, Madam Rochelle Root, your children here present, and all your family to the friendship, solidarity, and cooperation between the Republic of Mozambique and the Republic of Kenya, to peace and prosperity in Southern Africa and uh, Eastern Africa and the African continent, the world at large, to the health of those who are the owners of this uh, visit. I mean, the peoples of Mozambique and of Kenya and of all presents. Thank you very much. I therefore, ladies and gentlemen, invite you all to rise and join me in a warm toast. To the good health and long life of my dear brother, His Excellency Felipe Jacinto Nusi, and First Lady, Ms. Nusi, to the unity tranquility, wealth, and prosperity of the people and nation of Mozambique to the enduring promise of our shared future built on strong brotherly relations and to the long-lasting friendship between our nations and our people. Pública de Moçambique, pela banda e da música ligeira moçambicana. Assim, the bonds of culture and history between our two countries speak volumes of the possibilities that exist between our two nations. As you mentioned in your statement, Mr. President, Kenya participated in no small way in actualizing the struggle for independence of this great nation. And we are very, very proud 
of the achievements that have been made by the people of Mozambique ever since they became an independent nation. We congratulate you, Your Excellency, for finally, this year, bringing to an end the culture of violence in our politics. And we are proud of you. We commend all the leaders in Mozambique for embracing and celebrating the democratic credentials of your country. We are great believers, Your Excellency, that as a continent, the same way we said no to colonial domination that was imposed on us by force, violence must never have a place in the governance, in the politics, and in the political discourse of any nation. And we congratulate you for bringing the culture of violence around our politics to an end in Mozambique. We celebrate that achievement that you, Mr. President, became the president that brought this to an end. You have our support. You have our prayers as a continent as we march on as democratic countries. The Africa Continental Free Trade Area, which we are both signatories, both countries are signatories. The Tripartite Agreement, which again we have agreed that we are going to move it forward. The AFRIEXIM program that makes it easier for our business people to trade by making it possible for our business people to trade in local currencies are among the many instruments that we are putting in place to support the growth of enterprise and business in our continent as we forge ahead in dealing with the challenges that we have. This is what I see, Your Excellency, in the Kenya-Mozambique relations. A successful, opportunity-making partnership that is going places. And I am privileged to have the singular honor of leading this phase of our wonderful bilateral phenomenon with you, Your Excellency, on the other side. You are a very dear brother and true friend to me and to the people of Kenya and your consideration does me and my country much honor, which I highly appreciate. Your Excellencies, uh, ladies and gentlemen, it is again a proud moment for us to celebrate what has already been achieved by our predecessors who made it possible for us to make it easier for citizens to travel between our countries, to make it easier for trade, for investments, for the movement of goods, for the movement of services between our two countries. And I want to commit that Kenya will continue to play our part in making sure that we build on this very solid foundation to take our country into the future as we do our region and our continent as well. Our strategic partnership has been singularly successful in many domains and we have much to show for it. I bring warm greetings and messages of goodwill from your brothers and sisters, the people of Kenya. I'm informed that over a thousand Kenyans have made Mozambique their home. 
where they live in, and they do so in peace and security and pursue their livelihoods without let or hindrance. Likewise, members of the Mozambican diaspora have become full citizens of Kenya and excellent ambassadors of their brothers and sisters over here. Mozambique has therefore made a unique contribution to the diversity, strength, and resilience of the Kenyan nation. I know you know this, Your Excellency, because when you visited Kenya, you had the occasion to speak to the Makonde people, who unfortunately cannot vote for you anymore because they are now Kenyans. <laughs> Our strategic partnership has been singularly successful in many domains, and we have much to show for it. I bring warm greetings and messages of goodwill from your brothers and sisters, the people of Kenya. I'm informed that over a thousand Kenyans have made Mozambique their home, where they live in, and they do so in peace and security and pursue their livelihoods without let or hindrance. Likewise, members of the Mozambican diaspora have become full citizens of Kenya and excellent ambassadors of their brothers and sisters over here. Mozambique has therefore made a unique contribution to the diversity, strength, and resilience of the Kenyan nation. I know you know this, Your Excellency, because when you visited Kenya, you had the occasion to speak to the Makonde people, who unfortunately cannot vote for you anymore because they are now Kenyans. <laughs> I want to commit to you the partnership and the cooperation of the government and people of Kenya in dealing with the challenge of organized crime, terrorism, and violent extremism. So that we can stabilize our region, secure our countries, and provide the best possible opportunity for growth in our nations.